Talk about uh, some solutions there. When you were bowling, trying to get in mind of a fast bowler, uh, at the end of your run, um, there have obviously been some very well documented particular instances when uh, you're absolutely on fire. What, what sort of things were you thinking about? Anything at all? I think particularly the, the, you know, part of the pitch to look at or how about some play? Well, of course, in order to be successful, you know, firstly, you have to at least try and find out your opponent's weakness and their strengths. And then once you find the weakness, you, you, you try to prey on the weaknesses because you have to try and be at least one step ahead of them. You know, and it should not take you too long to know the strength of weakness because by the time you find out that if it's too long, they're probably 100. You know, and um, so you got to learn and learn quickly. My game plan was always very simple. I'm a very, very proud person and always want to be the best at what I do. And I want my team to be the best. And I'm also an aggressive person by nature. So my aggression is not something that you can learn. It's just it's a part of me. So with all my aggression in the middle, it's something that's natural. You know, I, 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 don't, I, don't, I don't sledge. I don't do that. I don't talk to the players. I don't do nothing to them. I just let the ball do the talking for me. My aggression, well, of course, my steer, that is part of my, part of my you know, my whole thing really you know look at you try to psych you out it's a bit of psychology try to let you think I'm thinking all kinds of things and quite frankly I'm thinking nothing you know it's just a bit of psychology really and um, but I keep my game very simple but um, you know because I like to win and the kind of pride I have in myself you know that those are my driving force to be successful